Hey everyone, this is X-Man here from DragonDevs.com and today I want to show you Christian Troy's build of CyEngine Mod 10. This is for the Ino Aurora 2 and the Elf 2. Uh, before we get started, I just want to say that Christian has been a great developer. Um, he constantly updates his ROMs. He's very quick to answer questions. Uh, big shout out to you, Christian. Thanks a lot for that. I also want to thank uh, mp4nation.net for providing this tablet to dragondevs.com. Thank you. And here we go. I just want to give you a quick overview of this ROM. Uh, later on I will do some in-depth videos about uh, some of the features. But right now we just want to see, just get an idea of what this ROM is all about. Some really nice features in the settings on this ROM. Uh, system settings. You know, you can adjust your status bar, uh, notifications, wallpaper of course. Now the power menu uh, that's really one of my favorites. Uh, <clears throat> you can enable screenshot, uh, expanded desktop. Expanded desktop is really nice. Um, the factory firmware for this tablet does have the expanded desktop but you have to go all the way in and out of the settings to activate it and deactivate it. Well with Christian's ROM here yeah, say you're watching Netflix or something like that, you don't want to back all the way out and you know change the desktop. So all you got to do is press the power menu and see the bar goes away. Press it again and then it's back, which is really neat. Uh, you can uh, take a screenshot from the power menu. Uh, they got reboot options. Um, really, a lot of nice features there. And another thing that I really like about this ROM is right here you can enable the dual display for HDMI which means when you plug it into the television you can either have the picture showing on the tablet and the television or if you want to save battery or just want to watch it on the TV you can turn this off Whoops. you can turn this off and it'll only show on the TV. Uh, the screen tablet will be black, which is really, really nice. Um, this ROM <clears throat> is running on uh, Jelly Bean. Um, it is 4.1.2. And one really neat thing about Christian's ROMs, a lot of them, uh, especially for the ones that, that the tablets that support HDMI. Uh, these ROMs support uh, play PlayStation and Xbox controllers and some other miscellaneous uh, aftermarket controllers, which is really neat because you can plug your tablet into the TV, you can plug your controller into the tablet, and it's like having a miniature game system there. It is really neat. And I'll do some videos, uh, some in-depth videos later about that and some of these other features. Um, I plan on doing a video how to root this and how to install Say Engine Mod. Uh, but this is just a really great ROM and everything is really smooth. Uh, it improves battery life, by the way, quite a bit. And um, Christian is just, uh, he's a great developer and he's quick to answer any questions. Uh, if you're interested in this ROM, there's a link below. Um, you can get it at dragondevs.com and thank you for watching there will be some more in-depth videos later on of some of the features uh, this is X-Man from dragondevs.com thank you